Lauren and this is Judy from Not Realistics and this is one of the ways I avoid food waste. Here's the background. I live with two other people who don't eat the same things that I do, which means that our fridge is often packed with their food and my food. Things are behind one another, some things are underneath other things, and some things get nestled in there and lost in that mess. While I really am an organized person, our fridge is shared space and looks like a disaster zone most of the time. Which means that if I put something in there and it's moved to make room for other stuff, I will likely forget about it because it's disappeared into the abyss and it'll go bad and be tossed out. So here's my system. I create an inventory list and tape it to my planner. You can tape it to your fridge or whichever place you see often so that you'll get reminders as well as make it easy for you to update. When I finish something, I'll cross it off. And when it gets too messy or is finished, I'll just make a new one. Instead of writing it directly into my planner, I keep it on a card or sticky note so that it's detachable and I can bring it with me to the grocery store. One, to make sure I don't buy more of something that I already have, and two, so that I can pick up foods that go well with what I already have. If writing out all the foods you have in stock is too much of a hassle, you can always tape your grocery receipts and cross it off as you go. I file my receipts in another section of my planner to remember to pay them, so I never use it as my inventory. Another option is simply reusing your grocery list before it's tossed out. Instead of crossing it off when you buy an item, just do a check mark. Once you've eaten it, then cross it off. I'm a visual person, so having that physical reminder that's not too cluttered is really helpful. Let me know if this helps you keep track of your produce and whether it helps you finish it before it goes bad. I'll see you next week. 